Good morning. This is Jan Payne empowering you to attract incredible possibilities. You know, we've been talking about how powerful thought is. That, you know, thoughts are things. And there is a passage that Bob Proctor prompted me to memorize several years ago. I think it was 1997. And I have it pretty much memorized. It takes me a while to do things. <laughs> anyway. This passage is from Thomas Trowan, and it goes like this. My mind is the center of divine operation. Divine operation is always for expansion and fuller expression, and that means the production of something entirely new, not included in past experience, though proceeding out of it by an orderly sequence of growth. Therefore, since the divine cannot change its inherent nature, it must operate in the same manner within me. Consequently, in my own special world of which I am the center, it will move forward to produce new conditions, always in advance of any that have gone before. Isn't that amazing? Think about this. Think about the power of your thought. Think about this. My mind is the center of divine operation. It's where it all starts. The divine operation is always for expansion and full expression. We always want more. And this means the production of something beyond what has gone before. Something entirely new, not included in past experience, though proceeding out of it by an orderly sequence of growth. Therefore, since the divine cannot change its inherent nature, laws do not change. It must operate within, in the same manner with me. Consequently, in my own special world, my world, of which I am the center, everything will move forward to produce new conditions, always in advance of any that have gone before. So, where you are now does not determine where you will be. Your current results do not dictate your future. Your thinking does. So think about it. Until next time, this is Jan Payne empowering you to attract possibilities.